day two in Mallorca and um, we woke up today and the weather still isn't great so if you watched my last video you would have seen that it was a bit like cloudy and windy it's still a little bit cloudy and windy I'm hoping it clears up the weather forecast said it should be like nice today but it's obviously lying because it is just a bit cloudy it's just really not Spain weather at the moment we've got our stuff ready to go down to the pool we're gonna go get breakfast first and have something to eat and then we will see what the weather's like but it's not it's not looking too promising this morning i'm a little bit like sad about it because i would have thought in like may like the end of may like spain would be quite hot but obviously not so <laughs> we'll just wait and see what happens for the rest of the day but if not we'll just have to drink lots of cocktails enjoy the all-inclusive yeah just enjoy the day so let's go get breakfast anyway room and we're about to head out because it's still pretty grey outside. We're gonna head out and get a taxi and hopefully see some caves. Mm -hmm. So that should be interesting. We're gonna try and make the most of the day and yeah see what we can see outside of the hotel in Mallorca. So let's go. We've just arrived at the Cave Subdrax, is that what it's called? Because it's only like a 15 minute drive to get here, we just had a taxi and it's cost 17 euros each to get in here. So we'll see if it's worth it. We'll see if it's like, it looks really cool online. So me and mum just came down to the caves. Our tickets aren't until 12, so we started queuing up and we're right at the front of the queue. Half an hour, yeah, so we've got half an hour to wait, but we're right at the front of the queue. Like, look at all the people behind us. <laughs> And the sun has come out. It is so nice and sunny Ooh. now. Nice and warm. Me and mum are so happy about it. Let me show you outside. It's just completely blue skies now, which is so nice. Quite a few more people down on the sun lounges. So I'm really excited to get out, get in the sunshine. And yeah, just sit and chill and read my book. The caves were really cool. Like it was definitely something to see. We also went on like a little boat across the like lake bit in there, like where there was water and it was just so cool. So yeah, definitely recommend going there if you do come here. It only took about an hour. Um, so it wasn't like a whole day thing. It literally was just an hour. So that was nice. and it's so beautiful up there not i don't think we'd stay here during the day which yeah, is nice for photos yeah so we're gonna go down and have some dinner now um but i'll show you mum's outfit quickly whilst we're waiting for the lift mum's got this like purpley pink dress on i absolutely love it, it looks so nice and then i've just got on this purple top which i always wear for the nasty gal and then my black trousers which i always wear this is like my go-to outfit and i love it and then my tag from boohoo 
And now we're getting in the lift to go to dinner. But we just had such a nice day by the pool. I'm so glad the sunshine came out. Like it just made the holiday. I have just woke up this morning and got my bikini on because it is such a nice day I just really want to get outside straight away so mum's gone down to go get a cabana um, so hopefully we can sit in there all day which will be really nice so I'm gonna go down and meet her in a second I woke up a little bit like congested I don't know if it's from like the air con or what or if I've got like a little cold out here but we'll see but I feel absolutely fine which is good but we're gonna go out enjoy the sunshine it's just purely blue skies today which makes me so happy I'm just so excited to get out there in the sunshine so today it's gonna be a pool day at the hotel so we're gonna go down and then probably get some breakfast in a bit as well and yeah just enjoy enjoy the sunshine I'm so glad it finally made its appearance yesterday because it just it honestly just makes such a difference when you're on holiday doesn't it like you kind of expect it to be sunny so yeah I'm really happy that the sun and has decided to appear. Today, there's literally like hardly any breeze we feel like me and mum were saying we feel like we've gone from one extreme to the other where it was like really like cold well not cold but like really windy and just like not the hottest weather to it like it is what is it like 26 27 degrees today isn't it mm. i went in the pool and the pool is absolutely freezing but i also think it doesn't help because obviously you're so hot sat here and then you get into like a cooler pool um but it's just so nice just to be able to have a little dip in the pool and i'm just reading my book we were saying that the food at this hotel is really nice the people are really nice and obviously the decor and everything is so nice so i'm actually really enjoying this hotel now mm. which is good now back in the room i've had a shower washed my hair we had just basically spent the whole day chilling by the pool and it was so nice so we've come up to the room i've showered and i feel a lot more fresh now which is good um but we're just going to kind of get ready for the evening go down to dinner just do all the kind of like usual stuff tonight so yeah I did try to book one of the a la carte's because they do have a few a la carte restaurants here but because we're only here for like for night we went to go book on the first day and everything was fully booked which is a little bit annoying to be honest the buffet food is so nice that actually i don't really mind at all which is good so yeah it's a bit of a shame we couldn't do the a la carte so that is one thing to know if you do come to this hotel that you might not be able to get in the a la carte restaurants but overall food is so nice me and mum also had some like ice lollies and stuff by the pool which was really good 10 out of 10 from me for the food and drinks this is my evening outfit that i'm gonna wear tonight so i've got this little red dress from pretty little thing on and i actually really like it it's quite like light, lightweight it's perfect for a hot day and in the summer and then i've just got my usual sandals on with it as well we're gonna head down to dinner in a second and get some food although i was just saying to mom that we're actually not that hungry because i mean it wasn't that long ago that we actually ate but you know that's just classic holiday all inclusive like you just eat the whole time i've also gone for no makeup tonight mom looks so pretty today i love your black dress love it very classy mum. <laughs> what for no makeup today because I was just like having a little like nap on the bed and I was just like I can't be bothered to do it tonight. Yeah I'll go au natural tonight so that is what we're doing. It was so sunny though it's like almost seven o'clock and it's still like such a nice day like the pool area gets so much sun doesn't it? Mm. Like the whole area. These are also all the swim up rooms which look quite cool but I reckon the swim up pools are really cold like no one's ever in them. So this morning me and mum were abruptly woken up by a fire alarm going off. Do you think it was a fire alarm in the yeah, end? Definitely. Um and it was so loud, like it wasn't like in the room, but it was just like outside of the room. 
So mum had a little look out the door, like, because you do that, like, classic where you look out to see if you actually have to, like, get up and get out of bed. Um, and mum had a look and, like, people started to, like, walk down, like, stairs. So I literally got up, got a dressing gown on, and then the fire alarm went off, so I ended up getting back in bed. But it was so strange, I don't know what caused it, like, we didn't get far enough to find out. But yeah, that was a bit annoying this morning, but at least we were all good. Yesterday we ended up watching a guy, like, singing some songs. Um, the entertainment is like a little bit boring at this hotel, like there's not really like tons going on. There was just a guy singing, um, and then we came up to bed quite early and started packing up our stuff because we actually leave today, which is so sad, and it is the most beautiful day, and I just, I don't want to go home yet, like I'm really sad, but we are feeling quite lucky because I've noticed on the news that quite a lot of like EasyJet flights have been cancelled out of Gatwick, and also a lot of TUI flights, which is so frustrating. Like honestly, I've been seeing on people's instagram stories that people have been getting to the airport waiting for hours and then it ends up their whole holiday has been cancelled like how frustrating must that be and i think it's because it's half term as well like a lot of people are wanting to get away and everything like that so yeah we're super lucky that we were actually able to get here in the, fir in the first place and i just checked our flights this morning and our flights look all good for easyjet at the moment which is good so fingers crossed we are actually able to get home we're just kind of like packing up the room now i think we're gonna go get some breakfast in a second um but i'm just so happy in the sunshine like the sun it just puts me in such a good mood let's go get some breakfast because i'm feeling a bit hungry this morning so but i'll show you the view outside of our window today because it's just such a lovely day look at the clear blue skies there's not even a cloud in sight mum just pointed out all the clouds <laughs> over here. i was looking out here not even a cloud apart from, <laughs> apart from all these over here also, the thing I love about this hotel is that it's literally already 9 o'clock and there are so many sun loungers free. Like, you don't have to fight for a sun lounger because that is the most awful thing on holiday when you have to get up at, like, 7am to get a sun lounger. There's just so many still available. So that is definitely such a perk of this hotel. We just had breakfast and we've just come to have a little sit down. <laughs> Mum's all the way over there. This sofa is absolutely massive. I actually like it. Like, when you sit back, it's just so hard to get back up. <laughs> Can't do it. <laughs> so we've just finished packing up the room. A suitcase is all packed. We're gonna be leaving this room behind and the view. I don't want to go home. I've actually enjoyed it so much. Goodbye view. We're actually not getting picked up until later today, so we've got a couple of hours just to like use the hotel, chill out. So we're gonna go check out now, leave our suitcases at reception, and yeah, maybe wander into like the town or wander to the beach again. So that is our plan. Who else stays at this hotel? We stayed in room 370. Hurry up. <laughs> Mom's telling me to hurry up. <laughs> put our suitcases at reception now we're just in a little shop doing a bit of shopping not really sure what we're buying but we're just having a little look um and just gonna i think we'll probably just walk along to like the seafront so that should be nice and then probably head back to the hotel get some more drinks you know enjoy the all-inclusive a little bit more <laughs> just chilling by the pool we're like fully clothed but not like in bikinis or anything so i feel a bit odd like sitting on a sun lounger no, i've got socks on yeah mum's got socks on <laughs> so we've got like about two hours until our taxi picks us up it was really nice to like walk along to the beach it's literally only like 10 minutes from our hotel so it's like actually a really good location um our hotel if you want to like go out and about a little bit really busy though because the summer's out yeah really busy like the beach and everything um but yeah for now we're just sitting there got a coke zero they put them in wine glasses i always feel a little bit weird drinking a coke out of a wine glass but anyway it's because it's sophisticated very sophisticated i feel really strange as well because i've got converse just sat on the sun lounger it's really not a good look yeah i know it's really just not a good look is it but we we'll have to do what we have to do. Cramming in the last few all-inclusive moments. Yeah, I know. <laughs> we'll go home and make our own meal soon. <laughs> this is very nice. <laughs> Me and Mum have got a minibus to ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> 